Okay, welcome everyone to a really, really, really late night version of Dungeon Crawl Stone Soup. Unfortunately, this is going to have to be a pretty short one today, on the account of the fact that uh, it's already 1.30, and I'm really tired. And, you know, there's been a bit of uh, consumption of alcohol, but that was mostly in good fun. Oh, that's Nicola. Okay, I'm not that dead yet. Uh, no resistance. Okay, so there's a chance that he just kills us flat out. A very good chance, actually. Um, there is an Arlek leather armor here, which I'm gonna go and pick up. Because Arlek might be, like, so important that it saves our life. And the slow is pretty bad. Um, but if it gets down to that, I'll probably just haste up. So yeah, I was, uh, at a mate's house playing, uh, what do you call it, <clears throat> uh, Munchkin. Uh, for those of you that don't know what that is, it's a, uh, it's like a D&D, &D, it's like a humorous kind of D&D &D game. It's pretty fun. I enjoyed it. But, yeah, essentially, you, it, it, like, very quickly becomes like a, kind of like a Cold War style, um, thing. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, but like it's really good. It, it was fun to play. Uh, you you can like screw your friends over, and I managed to pull like a really ridiculously cool move where uh, by the end of the game, I was like in dead last place, like for the whole game, for like the whole hour and a half that we were playing, or I think two hours actually. And at the very end, like I managed to pull into first place and tie a win from like completely out of the blue. That was pretty fun. Uh, but of course, the downside of that is that I was too late to record properly. But come on, like I gotta have some time for myself. Uh, this is like really bad because Asterion is like a mean guy, and he's gonna probably take us out really fast. Yeah. Oh my fucking god! Sixty-two damage from a warp from an orb of electricity. Classic Asterion. Classic. Oh my. Dark and God. I guess we have to keep playing this, right? Ah, oh, man. That really, oh man, that really grinds my gears. What the? No. Why do we? Oh, I like how like we had our elect and then it just randomly kills us. I'm like, oh, okay. Once again, the ability to do fifty plus damage in one turn is the reason why we die because we don't have the amazing our elect. I mean, we could have we could have went back to that leather armor, but um, it doesn't really make too much sense because it's a slow weapon. It's kind of bad. But I guess apparently this character is gonna have to play again. Oh boy, isn't that gonna be fun? Let's pick up Shroud of Galibria, I guess. Like I don't know, I'm too I'm too like in all seriousness, I'm quite sick and I don't care anymore. I just ah, oh, goddamn. I got like so much stuff to do now, like I'm really busy, but like it doesn't feel like any particular moment is busy, but there's always that fear that I'm going to be busy in the next like hour or so. So it's like right now I have not incredibly much to do because I have to record, but then after that I have to like study and it's like two in the morning already. Uh, I'm like, oh my god. Alright, I guess we'll go over then, whatever. That's fine. Like, at this point in time, I just want to win the Scald. I'm just pissed off. Because um, I think Scald's going to be a bit worse in the next version, so I think it's probably just a bit easier for me to just pick up Scald now while I have time. The reason why I say it's going to be harder is because if, for example, if for whatever crazy reason I decide that continuing on with the path of, um, uh, continuing on with the path of, oh man, that's a slim... That's actually worth using because I have a plus four to it, isn't it? Oh, Rue's not that good though. But, ah, whatever. We'll we'll train it a bit so that we can get the power. Uh, Shroud of Glubria here. Infusion. Hit him with the rocks. Hit him with the berserk rage attack, and we're still gonna die. Uh, heal. That was magic. Heal. That was haste. Heal. That was heal. Good. 
Uh, okay, we can just. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, he killed us from below. Damn it. Okay. Clearly, my reaction time is not good right now. But that's fine. Had a quick nip of cherry vodka right before I started recording. Per the usual. It's my pre uh pre video ritual. And I also have a bleeding nose. Um if I do sound nasally it's because of that. It's so like just today in general is a really bad day for me to record and it really does show. <sighs> I also died online too because I was playing on a different keyboard and then instead of pressing up I pressed down up and then completely killed me. I was like ah this was on my win rate account too, so I was pretty pissed. So, yeah, just in general, today has been a very bad day for me, crawl wise. I don't know. Like, I've only played like maybe 20 minutes, but I've already lost three characters. It's like, ah, uh, it's too much. But the idea of picking up a sling and sling bullets is really tempting. You know, we haven't really been able to do that. So, oh, that's cursed. Okay. I don't think it matters though, because we can just keep training the slings up anyway. Minus two is not that big of a deal. It's it's kind of a big deal, but like at the same time, we got sling bullets, we got stones. Sling bullets are very strong anyway. I guess the halfling scale will take a different direction than it was previously, simply because it's more convenient for me. Okay, so there's two more slings. No remove curse. Hoping that this isn't a curse sling. I have no idea what I'm doing now. Oh, this is the remove curse, right? This is plus zero, so it's like getting plus two sling. Not bad. But yeah, I, I, I completely forgot that halflings played slings. I was too busy thinking about them, like, in terms of, like, melee. And then I realized, wait a second, they have plus four slings. What am I doing? It's kind of like I forgot somehow. Even though I have played halfling. Actually, it's been it's been actually quite a while since I played Halfling, so yeah, that makes sense. <sighs> oh well, hopefully we can just get through this game because now I'm pissed. I'm sad about it. The fact that we died randomly it was so dumb too. Like we actually died because an orb of electricity hit us for like almost 60, 70 damage, and the only reason why we took that much damage is because we had our elect down. Like. Damn, it's a lot of health that I took, a lot of damage. I mean, I could have healed wounded, um, but had the shock step and hit me at the same time, I would have died anyway. Like the problem is, like, I was trying to get it so that Asterion and the shock step weren't hitting me at the same time, and it was a relatively unexplored floor, so I was like, ah, I can teleport, not great, because I was already kind of low health by the time I decided to move. But yeah, he still kind of attacked me, like, way too much damage. Just in the classic fashion of um, hilarious swingy combat. Oh, come on. Thank you. I'll just go ahead and keep smacking him with the, uh, the sling bolts. It's pretty good. There's another Ash and Zari game. Um, I think it's decent to pick Ash and Zari, but I don't really know if I want Ash and Zari. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Okay, that's kind of good. Haste, heal wounds. Hit him with the thing, come on. God damn it. Okay, he's at range, that's fine. Once he's at range, I'm not too scared. Uh, we don't really, we're not going to get removed curse for a while, so it's kind of not good for me to go Ash and Zari. I know it's a weird decision to make, but in all honesty, the pal spike is not going to come for a while, so it's not a huge deal. Oh god. I'm going to have to use the, yeah, I'm going to use the random effects there. Because if I get a bolt, I just win the fight. <clears throat> no, don't smite me. No. There we go. Ah, <sighs> my god. Curse Ring of Teleportation. Classic. Let's get rid of that. Thankfully, we had to remove Curse on time. Would have been pretty bad if we didn't. Not incredibly bad, but kind of bad. Okay, okay, you kind of remember that you hate iguanas because they do so much damage. I think, like, iguana max damage is like something crazy, like 16 or 20. It's pretty ridiculous. It's really strong. They're a 10 speed monster, they hit really hard. Disturbingly so. 
I think Song of Sling actually might be good here. Maybe. The reason why I say that is because um you could argue that because I'm ranged, I can like hit stuff before they hit me, and I can get slain. I don't know if that's real. It's just a prank. I don't know. But hey, did it. That's Temple. Let's check out where Temple is. What's in Temple, sorry. Probably gonna go Okawara if I find him. Uh, yeah. Okawara is the um, patron god of like. Uh, what do you call him? Scald, so, you know, it's kind of cool. It's an interesting idea. Howling Monkey can't howl when he's dead. It's good. <clears throat> so with all these undead. The tiles look really weird and it's like creeping me out a bit. But yeah. Rest in peace. Ah, uh, and that's a killer bee. And that's a phantom. Not hilariously out of depth, but just out of depth enough to piss me off. Oh my god, please stop. Okay, we got him. We got the guy. Just gonna tab some of this stuff. This, only the imp's gonna come up anyway, so it's not a huge deal. Killing him is very straightforward. He doesn't do enough damage to really be a threat to us. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some sling bullets. This might take a while. Okay, so with Okawara, the reason why um, scouts like Okawara is because he provides EXP to your melee skills, which is really important for a aspiring Hoth. Oh, classic Ogre. God damn it. Well, at least he didn't random energy us. That would have been really grounds for salt. But yeah. As I said before, oh my. Please stop. Yeah, I hit him with the random effects. That could have been like really bad for us, but honestly, it was bad for us no matter what anyway, right? Okay, now a giant bullfrog is going to fucking kill us, because apparently we're not strong enough to fight that, and then a centaur immediately shows up after that. Perfect. If it weren't for the fact that we had some kind of stealth for some reason. Zero, actually. We'd be dead. Okay. Well, the problem with slings here... Oh, there's the same bullfrog, except that this time we completely kill it without taking any damage. Perfectly consistent combat. Not swinging in the slice, not variant at all. Every time. Exactly the same. Predictable. Consistent, even. That's a lot of undead, man. I don't think I could have used it in any way. Could have gone fed ass, maybe, but uh, that involved me going fed ass. 300 gold for that much stuff is pretty good. One extra AC is also really good here. Even if it's cursed, it doesn't matter. It's one AC that I didn't get before. Pretty important. So the unfortunate thing is that with just plain old leather armor, our character kind of sucks. So... We're kind of looking for a bit more stuff to get us through this uh, early game. Okawara should be pretty helpful, but... The reason why I picked him is because A, yeah, Scalds do like the extra combat ability because it means that they can skimp a little bit, train a bit more magic, and then that gives them the ability to do stuff. Um, also useful for this particular character because uh, it provides me with uh, extra bullets, which is going to be nice. Okay, unless we die here. Uh... Sling bullets. A single adder zombie is almost about to kill us. Okay. That's fair. Sling bullets. Should I just like keep. No, I need to kill him before he regenerates all his health. I was thinking of pillar dancing until I got. Oh, that's. Why did that auto explore? I'm just gonna random effects that thing until I can get it killed. I need to kill this troll somehow but it's like really fast and gonna kill me. I guess I can heroism it, probably. If I don't die to this goddamn ant. Alright, so the next time I see that troll, I'm gonna heroism it from full screen and then hopefully just pepper it. Okay, there's a sky beast here. Let's turn on our stuff, our heroism. Okay, it didn't work. We're not even scratching that thing. And we're about to die now. And... Okay. 
Okay, just dodge the thing. Yep, okay, perfect. Heroism, sling bullets, sling bullets. No choice but to just shoot it. Just keep shooting. Apparently at this point so the sky base is like quite dangerous because I got some piety from that. I'm gonna heroism here just so I can blast this guy with the stones so that I don't die. I'm gonna keep training Dex this time because I feel like it's pretty important to get Dex now. I don't know, this character is slightly less melee uh, magic focused than I was originally intending, so it's a little bit better, I guess. Plus, your dagger protection is pretty good. Oh man, we're actually running out of stones, which is hilarious. Sling bullets, stones. Let's hit the heroism so we can just kill this thing with the stones. Okay, never mind. Okay. I guess. We have to wait for random energy to get us out of this. There's no way we're going to be bailed out by consumables because we don't have any left. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why does this character suck? It heals bad, man. We can random energy, I guess, but that's going to get us killed. Like, it's not a good idea. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, that's hasty. Nope. I essentially want to hit this thing with like a big bolt because that'll help kill this easily, like that. And I get a wand of lightning for my troubles, which is really helpful for me. Um, I'm gonna continue to just blossom with this stuff. Oh my god. The reason why I'm doing this is because a um, it's essentially free. Because, like, I'm never going to use random effects anyway. And B, it's like in a very controlled environment where I can almost guarantee myself a kill if I just get the right random effect. Unfortunately, though, it looks like my luck is starting to run out a little bit. I guess we'll recharge it, even though that's kind of dumb. I just need to kill, like, there you go. Like, you just need one good shot of that random energy, and then you're perfectly fine. Oh, what the hell? Why did it teleport it? Oh, man. That was not an expected outcome. Okay. Well, whatever. Gonna heroism here just to take this electric heal out, please. Oh, my god. Okay, well, we took it out somehow. Oh, my god. This character, why? We're being punished or something. I don't know. Heroism here. Still gonna die. Oh, we have a lightning one. Never mind. As long as we use our lightning one smartly, we won't die. That's a troll. We can't fight the troll. We might be able to fight it with like every single weapon at our disposal, but not right now. Okay. Classic backspawn. Just per the huge. Can't run away. And a heroism here, just fight, I guess. I don't know. Like, there's literally no place for me to go at this point. Like, <sighs> okay. How about we just zap shit? Hmm? How about that? Just zap stuff. How about that? Is that a good idea? I think it's a good idea. Let's heroism here as well. Just mess with these guys. Really beat them up. All right. Screw them. How do we get 13 AC? What do we drink? What? I have no idea what we drink. It wasn't Berserk Rage. Um. Oh, yeah, it added like. Oh, no, it was the. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. It was our protection one. Right. Right on, man. Okay, so how to kill this troll. So I think the best way to kill the troll is to get a double zap on it, and then heroism, and then just beat it to death with the dagger. Like I just did. It looks like the, the skills here are not being very well used. I'm going to turn training of charms off completely. Start switching a bit into long blade, into short blade, and a bit into dodging. I think it's pretty important now, because we seem to not do anything. 
This character is like the epitome of suck fail. Just absolutely nothing going for him. But at the end of the day, it's still a character in full, and that means that it's winnable. Unfortunately, though, for some reason, we're getting screwed by stone RNG, which makes no sense because that's not a thing that you get screwed by regularly. But it's happening to us. Literally 13 stones. I guess we have to go buy stones. That's embarrassing. Wow. Uh, I can't afford that. Right. Uh, stones. 14 stones. We bought it. <laughs> we had to buy rocks. God damn it. <laughs> we are getting trolled right now. By someone. Some entity on, under the earth. Because we're sure ain't a good guy. Uh, okay, the slings, the extra stones come in handy a lot, I guess. Akawaru is kind of pleased at us. That's nice. Always nice to know that he has our back. Heroism, I guess. Sling bullets so we can kill him. Nope, we got random energy and then we got back spawned. Uh, okay. Well, what are we going to do here? Like, what do we have to do here? We're running out of resources. And then we just get beset upon by double frog, because that's just normal. But that was random. Sling bullets. I'm actually out of stuff to fight. Like, what the hell? I just have to use heroism, I guess. Just beat him up. Yeah, there you go. There's one with an even stronger ability. Right. Exactly what we wanted. Fashion of Holy Wrath. Okay, how about we just buff up like crazy and just go at him? That worked. Kind of. Okay. All I need to do is get to Lair and then I'll leave it for future demise to handle. Because right now I'm just... I'm really out of it. Oh, okay, no. No. No, 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 no. <sighs> no. Please, God, no. Just let me do me. Stop bothering me. My god. There's a centaur. It's D6. Had to fight like 15 ogres already. A troll. Oh, there's the one of acid. It's going to be very useful for us. Let's just skip all the whites, I guess. Why not? Beating everything up with the short blade, apparently. It's pretty good. How much is the slings Mindalay? 12. Okay, so we don't need that anymore. Um, I'm going to pick up the rapier because it's a short blade. We might get a brand scroll, which could be useful. I'm going to hit him with the acid before I start the fight, just because it debuffs him so badly that I might actually win like I did. There's another troll because we wouldn't have this game without two trolls this early in the game. Thankfully, we're at a stage now where we can actually handle it, which is nice. Okay, I'm going to need ridiculous value off this to make it work. Yeah, there we go. Take two bolt, two enemies out with that bolt spell. That's why I say acid's so damn good in the early game. It's actually really relevant. It does a lot of damage. But we're pretty much entirely out of gas now. Like, we do not have a lot left. We are running very low, unfortunately. The gas is... Uh, okay, that's a hellhound. Pushing a haste, that's nice. Pushing a heal wounds, I guess. Gonna enchant the weapon of protection, because this is like the last fight pretty much. Ah, uh, and we fucked up. Nope. Okay. No, nah, I'm pissed off now. Clearly, I am not playing properly. I'm going to take a break, because, like I said, this is a very, very late night thing. I've been up for like. 20 something hours and I'm just like at the end of my rope. I didn't want to record today, but you know how it is. You gotta, you gotta keep that recording streak up, but uh, sometimes you gotta ask yourself, was it worth it? And in this case, actually it wasn't, so you know how it is. Anyway, guys, um, yeah, I'm gonna go back to speedrunning for a bit, uh, I think. So tomorrow there probably will be a speedrun vid 
if if there is time. Uh, there might not be time. I'm actually really stuck for time for the next couple of days. I might actually just, I don't know. I might have to take a break. I don't know. It's like legitimately there's not a lot of time left uh, for the next two weeks, uh, two days. Just for some reason, like my whole schedule is just completely fucked. Like I can't do anything about it. It's unfortunate, but yeah, you know what I mean. So yeah, uh, stay tuned for more. I'll, I'll try to put content out, but if I can't, you know, forgive me because <sighs> God, I'm actually kind of stressed now. I'm really far behind on my work. I've got a goddamn party to go to. It's not my party. It's someone else's. I've got like a whole bunch of shit that I have to get done on like the day. I have to go to the doctors because my nosebleed thing is like becoming chronic, or it has been chronic. And it's getting really fucking annoying, and I need to get surgery or something to clean it up. Or they can remove my nose. I don't know, one of the two. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a whole bunch of bad shit, and I'm just like completely out of it right now. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all tomorrow, or the next day.